You haven't been in the seat since you were at Bathurst, you know, last um, last November. Was it November or December? Yeah. Yep. Uh, December. Yeah, December. December. Late December. Yep. Uh, uh, early December. Early December. Yeah. But um, so first off, you're in a brand new car, but you're at a track yep. that you already know. So it's kind of like kind of. Kind of good, kind of bad. <laughs> like, yeah. what's what's your uh, your sort of mindset going into it this round? I am not complicating this weekend at all. Um, you haven't done a that, test day, have you? No, nah, no. Nah, we are going into this uh, fresh as. So <laughs> it's gonna be it's gonna be an interesting weekend. Um, I'm planning on making it as uneventful as, as possible in, in terms of, you know, any negative results going on. Um, and we're just going to try and do our best to get through. I think the top 10, top five would be great for us. And then we can really sit down after Bathurst and think about what we're, what we're going to do for Sydney. Um, but I've got to tell you, having the one year break out of the seat from COVID and then going straight into Tassie last year and sort of being toe-to-toe with Chaz straight away in quality, that gave me a hell of a lot of confidence to, to know that if I ever am out of the seat for a long time, mm. I should be able to get in and adapt pretty quickly within you know a session or so and away we go. So the, the biggest challenge this weekend is going to be adapting to a, a new car um, around possibly the one of the hardest tracks in the world. So no big deal, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah, you'd yeah. be right. Oh, yeah, what, what could go wrong at Bathurst? <laughs>